Game on. Hello friends, Stubby here, playing some more Happy Room. So I'm actually over in the sandbox, just trying to get maximum damage and see what happened. So, actually my first room I set up worked out pretty good. I tried to record it yesterday. <laughs> I got my first test run, worked great. Did seven tests, I think it was, trying to record and couldn't get it to work. So, fired up this morning, tried again, and first go was good. <laughs> I'm gonna jump on in and see what happens. So, this is a little sandbox action in the happy room. Let's see what we got. This is what I built. I uh, didn't take as long as I would have thought to get all the mines in place. So, let's go ahead with number one here and see, see what happens. It does log, uh, bog down a little bit, so I go to quarter speed. Then it seems to keep up a little bit better. Wish you can kind of get some ideas to what's happening. My first run ever on this board, I had almost, well, I'd say 90 to 95% in one combo. It was like 70,000 or something. So I had originally had, I think, grenade launchers up on the top, but they were pushing them down into the, the pads and wearing them out. So we got rid of that. Then I had, uh, what if I put rockets up there? That didn't work out much better. So I reluctantly upgraded the fire and stuck the fire guns up there so that they wouldn't actually impact his trajectory. All right, looks like we're still on a single, uh, uh, <clears throat> a single combo. It's where it looks hard to see at the same time, but it looks like the values are still the same. So we'll see how far we can get this combo. It'd be nice if I can get the combo to go all the way to the end. But that gets difficult as the mines start to deplete. And the fire up on top, I would like to have something that does a little bit more damage. For right now, they seem to be working. It's not a lot of extra. That's what we have. Almost 69,000 combo. It's not bad. Yeah, I mean, they're working, but there's not a whole lot of, like, excess damage. It would be nice to have enough to just ensure that you're going to get there every time. That's not the case with this. You're, you're teetering at the edge of what you got. And maybe I can get something more destructive on the walls. Again, I'm trying not to put anything out there that will affect its trajectory because that seems to ruin the jump pads. It's a catch-22 with the, the grenade launchers. Oftentimes, it kind of helps keep moving around, but even though they save the jump pads a while, it also seems to make them wear down quicker somehow. Because he doesn't spend as much time actually crossing the board, I think that's what it is. So we're at 78,000. We got one jump pad down. Still got a few grenades or uh, mines left. Oh man, pushed him right out of that one. 79. So we're getting there. It's close. Hopefully we can, hopefully we can get him. There's a couple more mines. We still got one last fire gun and a little bit of ice left. Wow, we're almost 80,000 and our, we still got an ice gun left up there. That's something. All right, now our corner pad is worn out. That's not good. There we go. The mine's keeping it moving. Come on now, missed that corner. Ah, of course he's... Uh, this guy's like a magnet for the corners. And there we go. 80,000. You gotta be kidding me. Ah. <laughs> the max damage is 80,500. I hit it on the first try ever. So... And I think I left off the last time I tried to record at 80,409 or something. <laughs> oh, stupid game. All right, let's try it. try it one more time. Do I change something up? I mean, I don't know. Acid's not that good. I'm not sure. I had the plasma guns on the ceiling, I think. 
Let's try this again and see what happens. I can put plasma guns down the walls, maybe, if they fit. Let's try this one more time and see how it goes. I can try doing it at normal speed if, if you guys want to see it, but it, I mean, it just hangs up for a second at a time. Which doesn't sound like a long time, but it is. <laughs> it really is. If I closed everything else down on my PC, it might run a little bit better, but... I think it's it's beyond that. And I'm not driving no potato. I mean, I got a GTX 1080 and a i7-6700. And I'm actually only running it at 1080 because that's what I'm recording at. Where is he? Hiding in the smoke. Oh, he's really bogging down this time around. When it bogs down like this, I wonder how much of it actually registers. <laughs> the sound is great. Whoa. Where is he? There he is. So up to 65,000 in this combo so far. That's pretty good. I think, I mean, the ice, the ice and mines is definitely among the better options for really doing maximum damage. I mean, look, we're looking at 70,000 damage. That's that's a lot. Now oh, that jump pad's getting worn out already. That's not good. Maybe I should mix a couple. Like, these guys down here switch directions on them or something, one of these two, so that they, they don't all cut straight across. That's just 75. We got a lot of fire left. And we've already got one jump pad worn out, and it's a corner one. Or two, and they're both corner ones. It's not, that's not good. I think it was 77. Oh, I didn't even notice. I was looking at the jump pad. We, uh, we lost our combo, and he's done. Quitter. No one likes a quitter. All right, you know what? I think we're going to make some changes here. This just ain't doing it. And I'm not going anywhere near that trash can, because I really, really don't want to. Ah, oh, the figures. I didn't set that up to have guns over there. Does a gravity gun do damage? Doesn't matter because it's good anyway. I mean, I could take those ice out. I don't really want to. I don't want anything of those. Hmm. Let me go back to laser orders. This fits. Ah, stupid thing. So we go top to bottom. And these are the ones the mini lasers and uh, Tesla coils. I don't know why you gotta select them every time. Well, I could put the disco ball back out too. I took the disco ball out thinking maybe it was causing the the lag or helping to cause the lag, but it doesn't seem to make a difference. The lasers are cheaper, so I was assuming they did less damage than the Tesla coils, but that was just an assumption based on perceived logic, which is generally never a good thing in video games. Or people in general. Logic is not so common. Equal you. Ooh, wow, I was off the screen too and it didn't fall away. I don't think I'll fit another one. I will not. Okay. Now, let's see what happens here. Quarter, quarter. Hmm. 
Laggy, laggy. Still moving. Lots of fire. Where are we? I, I see smoke. Number three. Come out of the smoke. There we go. We still got all those limbs. Nope, there goes one. I do know that when he screams, it means that one of his body parts came off. Oh, this is going pretty quick. Maybe the laser ores are good. He's got a ton of body parts. Came off right at once there in the corner. Where is that torso? There it is. Alright, it's actually going halfway decent. Those lasers last for quite a while. Picking up a few more mines. This is good. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could get like a beefed up jump pad. Just putting two in the corners would be really nice. I can't find a decent way to keep them out of the corner. Alright, so we're at 73. It's going pretty well here. It's missing some mines. 74. Ah. 74 8 for a combo. Not bad, but we could do better. Be nice to see a max combo come out here, but at this point, I'd just like to see him finish. Oh, that's a good number of mines there. Where is that torso at? Oh no. Stay left. Uh, it's not looking good. It's not looking good for coral number three here. Definitely need to do something about this corner to corner thing. I'm not sure how to circumvent that. I think maybe rotating a couple pads so that they don't all go to the corner is the only thing I can think of. Maybe a few shotguns to push them around. That could help, because shotguns don't have a real long distance on them, right? So if I take these guys out, take you out, come back to guns, we'll do uh, something with some some kick, but not a lot of distance. Is what I'm, oh, I can't put them on the ceiling. It's for figures. I put those on the ceiling. Those have too much range. I put those on the ceiling. All right, that's these guys. Man, I can't put nothing on the ceiling that I want to. Hmm. No. Um, there's nothing really gunnish in here. What can we do? What can we do? Ah, see, this is... I don't want to upgrade... Minigun's got a decent distance on it. I only got one upgrade point left. Uh, well, the minigun is upgraded. The upgrade doesn't let you put it on the ceiling? That's crap. Um, hmm. Yeah, there's not... Floor and ceiling on the shotgun. Yeah, I hate to do it. I really hate to do it. I don't want to. I don't want to. Hopefully we can get two of them in here. And in here. Maybe this will be enough to just knock them back a little bit away from the corner. We'll see. And we also want to do jump head. Maybe a 
third one. Happy. And maybe we go up. We'll try this and see. I don't think this is a good idea. You know what? I don't. We can try the second one, but then this is this might just keep him in the corner more. So let's we'll see. Maybe this is not a good idea. So we want to go left on this one. You're right on that one, left on this one. We shall see. I'm not horribly optimistic. Curious to see how the shotguns do, if they keep them out of the corner. All right, well he definitely fell away from the corner bumper, which is good, except now he's going to hit that bouncer, which is going to push him back to the right, probably, most likely, maybe, could be, potentially the case, if he ever shows back up again, he's a little bit frozen, wow, I bet you the laser made, or the disco ball made the difference, I don't think it was the shotguns. I think we have to get rid of the disco ball. Is this number four? I think this is number four. Wow, he is lagged out. Something serious. Yeah, he's uh, he's about stopped. <laughs> oh, he's moving. Just a giant orange ball of four. Well, that cost two impacts on the bumper. That's not good. Uh, hopefully, as he wears some of the stuff down, it'll go a little. Yeah, there we go. It goes a little bit quicker. Oh, there goes some body parts. It's going slow. I mean, the damage is going fast. The dude is going slow. Now we're way up there and just hit the left hand side of the board. Alright, this is going pretty well. Of course, it's always the end that's critical. We shall see what happens. Okay, so that that left bumper, the second one out, actually seemed to help a bit. Helped him pick up some of the mines along the edge. Where is he? It would be nice to have a little bit more uh, variable direction when he comes off the launch pads. If it weren't so consistent, he'd be picking up a lot more. Not bad, not bad. We got a couple more mines. There we go. Right through the pile of mines. And he got deflected away from the corner jump pad. This has a little potential. We'll see. We've been at this long enough to not get my hopes up. There's a couple more mines. A little bit more ice over on this side. Now ah, we're at 78. Maybe. We got a couple mines, got a couple more mines. Couple more. Oh, nice. Oh, we really swept the mines up on that one. Ooh, ooh, I think we might actually get there. Sweet. Minality. Finally. A fatality in the sandbox. That's right, 80,500 maximum damage is what it takes in the sandbox to get them done. So that's it. And actually, that's my first nice screenshot for Minality. Normally, he ends up going over to Minality and wiping out some of the mines in it. So this is great. Awesome. And actually, that puts me right at 20 minutes for, uh, for the episode. So I'm going to call it here. 
So this is Happy Room, little sandbox playing. So leave me a like and a comment down below. Let me know what you want to see me try out in the sandbox or in a regular game. I might go back and try to do all the tasks. I think I saw it somewhere that there's 120 tasks, so I got quite a few more to go. So I might go back and try some of that in the future episodes. Yeah, leave me a like and a comment. I'm Stub. You guys are awesome. We'll see you in the next one. Game off.